everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to discuss the operational stage of cognitive theory given by Jean Piaget. So and between the ages of 7 to 12, this stage is called as concrete operational stage in which the child master various conservation uh, concepts and begin to perform still other logical manipulation like uh, they can order object on the basis of dimensions such as uh, height weight etc like for example if he wants to have a ball he would be asking like it uh, it has no corners or if he wants a triangle he would be saying that it has three corners and if he's asking for a rectangle he would be like it's a bit long with uh, four corners so these are the thing if you ask a five-year-old child to uh, take you to their friend's house they will definitely going to take you to, to their friend's house but if you ask them to draw a map for you they won't be able to do that but if you ask the same thing with uh, to an eight-year-old child he is readily going to make a map for you so uh, Jean Piaget called this a uh, stage as concrete operational stage although the child is using abstract terms but still um, he or she is doing so on only in relation to concrete objects not until the final stage of cognitive development the formal operational stage which begins around 11 and 12 years the youngsters are purely able to reason on symbolic terms in one test for formal operational thinking, they can also form a mental representation of a series of actions. Like for example, if you notice a child who is in operational stage, he or she can uh, make a series of actions. Like if you uh, observe them while playing, they can actually do these series of actions like for example okay um, i i i will be uh, cooking food and you will intervene in my home you would be thief and you are going to kill me and then you have to call 911 and you are the nurse you are going to help me and you are the policeman you are going to arrest this thief these are the series of actions which actually uh, children in operational stage does and definitely if you are a keen observer you definitely would have observed these series of actions in the children play so I have observed it and so I can tell that so if we talk about formal operational thinking uh, in one test a subject tries to discover what determines the amount of time that a pendulum will swing back and forth and it's a period of uh, oscillation it is called as period of oscillation and the subject was presented with a uh, length of string suspended from hook and several weights uh, and strings and he can alter the way he want and then the children still in the concrete operational stage will experiment uh, changing some variables but not in a systematic way.